I'm having trouble with that. Holding my ground, you know, I've been <clears throat> under a lot of pressure since I graduated from school to to get a real job. That that attitude of that the work I do isn't real. Mm. Yeah, how do you not succumb to like the sugar or the sodium or the alcohol? Like, how do you just <laughs> Yeah, because the, the the frequency, the energy in the city is so intense that it's pulsing through your physiological mm -hmm. being. And so even if you know that the lentils and the kale and the tea <laughs> is the thing to do, you sometimes go to the opposite and Let sabotage your whole system. <laughs> Not wanting to let money be parts of the decisions of why I do things. No, I, think there's, uh, mm -hmm. I think there's a trouble. There's a trouble that, you know, sometimes... Uh, uh, we're all stubborn, you know. Like artists are very stubborn. <laughs> and on the other hand, you know, the, the, the corporate culture is very stubborn, you know. So I think we need to find a way uh, how your inner uh, journey can be actually, uh, can find a place in your heart and also in uh, find a way of uh, uh, coming together, you know, bringing all the resources together, you know, because we need resources. And the problem is sometimes, you know, like they all start like, you know, Love City Love, many good organizations, then they become later on like a big giant corporation, right? And then they totally forget about the original vision and so forth. And then others stay to the, you know, core vision, and then never makes it, you know, never can make it, you know, break through all the these resource. struggles, you know? And so I think if you find a middle way, you know, where you can actually get resources at the same time, not to lose the original vision and the heart at the same time, you know? So that's why I'm saying, you know, in the beginning that the misunderstanding and undervaluing undervalued, you know, uh, uh, perception of artists is a big problem. You know, that's the biggest problem there and need a lot of education. And I think there's also, uh, internally speaking, I think uh, <clears throat> one should be true to one's own heart and desire, you know. Um, at the same time, you know, one has to be skillful you know, skillful in terms of accomplishing that. You know, sometimes you can have a really good heart, but if you're not skillful, you, you don't accomplish what actually you can accomplish with that good heart. So that's why I think, you know, the, the balancing of the two is the most difficult piece. And that's why you find only a few people who can do that. And the nature of human beings is that human beings are not all inclusive at all. There's nothing, maybe, I mean, maybe nothing even healthy about yeah, it. And intrinsically, we all have potential, yeah. you know, to to have all these positive, you know, love and kindness and generosity and sharing, everything. You know, we have that 